Hi, I'm Yusuf. In this video, we will machine our second four axis indexing part. First, we will machine it with uh, classical methods like Planarmal, as you know. Uh, in uh, now many uh, in many shops, cam cam operations are made for these type of parts with generally planar milling but it's really hard to uh, make a planar milling operation let's see uh, what's the hardness of it first we must make a sketch for that Okay, now we will choose that sketch, we will choose a tool, curves, wonders are closed, tool side inside, connected, plane, 10 millimeter above. Uh, and we will choose all them on and we will change this down to because uh, in this uh, edge tool shouldn't touch to the surface okay we click ok follow periphery z pass 1 inwards okay and i click generate we didn't choose a floor plane i choose that plane and click generate as you can see uh, creating a planar mining operation is really hard uh, and if you make a, a wrong wrong choice for example, I didn't change it uh, on to Tantu. It will gauge the part because uh, it doesn't calculate the 3D geometry. Okay, as you can see, all the uh, uh, old school uh, cam logic is not. Uh, is not proper for today okay now we will make with modern uh, modern logic I choose my tool I choose the um, <coughs> floor cut pattern and Z pass you don't have to click enter Okay, what do I change? Uh, Invert. You can change, you can uh, add a smoothing to that. Okay. Direct previous plane backup. And no heights. Okay, I click generate. smoothing is too much okay Let's verify that.
uh, we will machine the, uh, the outer sides first then we will machine the inner slots or holes okay I copy that paste it you must wait uh, for uh, the for the operation i change the floor and choose the other past it and change the floor i do not choose any uh, tool axis generate it it see the cylindrical cylindrical blank and do not make any air move uh, unlike planar mill I passed the last operation change the floor and click generate it see the other parts and do not extend the tool uh, until the parts uh, part boundaries okay I make the uh, roughing tool pads then I will now I will machine the small slots I again change the floor wall with IPW or I can pass it again no, no. Uh, there is smoothing but uh, here there must be smoothing I create a new operation I choose the tool how uh, how do I choose the tool minimum diameter is that I choose the floor choose the pattern uh, increase the maximum distance and click generate <coughs> Now there seems there is no problem, but there is a problem. Uh, the tool doesn't cut that edge. Uh, we must extend the tool pads. Cutting parameters: containment tool overhang means extended edges. You can think like that. 100% of tool and click generate and you can see that now everywhere is machined there are, there are no materials left okay in all in uh, old style cam logic how will you machine this this uh, slot and this hole? You you uh, machine it level by level. You first machine until this face, then you will machine uh, uh, this face, and you must create a sketch for boundaries. But now you don't need it. I just select the floors and it chooses the walls automatically okay follow periphery depth per cut 
Transfer Rapid Direct Previous Play Backup and click just click generate you can see that uh, this engage moves are uh, too too hard to engage you change the ramp angle and uh, you decrease the height and you change the outward to inwards and click generate it machines the uh, this until this level and it machines the hole it's very simple as you can see okay now we will machine this side I copy that paste it uh, you should use copy paste because I made the arrangements here the cutting moves and non cutting moves you sh uh, the cut pattern depth per cut you shouldn't have to make it again just change the floors okay click ok and just click generate that's all because all arrangements are done before uh, as you can see this uh, edge isn't machined you can machine it in this side or if you want you can machine uh, in the second side how you can change the container tool overhang to hundreds Okay, it extends the tool pads. Why doesn't it machine it uh, in the first place? Because the tool pads uh, are created not on the floor surface. So uh, if you want to create it, uh, even it's not on the uh, floor, you change the tool overhang value. Okay, let's look how it machines. It's okay. We will machine this two other sites in uh, in next video because uh, if we machine them it will take too long and the video will be uh, too long so I will machine them in other in next video thank you for watching if you like the video please uh, press the like button <coughs> and if you haven't subscribed yet please subscribe